home gardeners that are trying to grow grapes in their backyard really have a challenge when it comes to pruning. Part of understanding what to prune and when to prune is understanding plant terms. Clearly the grapes have a permanent root system and a permanent trunk area. It'll either have usually one or two trunks, depending upon the pruning technique you're going to use. And after that, it moves up here to something called an arm. And then off the arm is something called a renewal spur. And each year, either very late in the winter or very early in the spring, as these have already been pruned for the growing season, you prune back to leave just a number of buds, maybe three to five, six to eight, it depends upon the pruning system again, on the renewal spur. These renewal spurs then will provide us with the grape clusters from this for this year and additional vegetative growth for next year's pruning, as well as to be the food factory to complete the grape clusters that hangs down here in the plant. So when we are pruning our grapes, typically we are talking about removing anywhere between 85 and 95% of the foliage and vine growth that was here from the previous season. So in grapes, we leave the trunk, we leave the arm, we leave a little bit of the fruiting spur or the renewal spur to create the grape clusters for this year and to put on a renewal spur for next year. Mm -hmm.